these next two and a half weeks, I'll be traveling to Croatia. During my time there, I'll be seeing some of the most stunning locations heading down the coastal islands along the Adriatic. I'll start in the capital of Zagreb, where I'll spend the first three days. I ordered a traditional Dalmatian dish, it's called Pashticada. Here's the Cathedral of Zagreb. Every day, for the last 100 years, it shoots a cannon at 12 o'clock noon. 100 grams black powder. Well, he's gonna set this thing off. From the capital, I'll then visit Split, Havar, Korchula, and finishing up in Dubrovnik. This will start becoming more of the vacation part of my vacation. But I'll be there towards the end of October, which happens to be on the cusp of fall. So I'm curious to see what it'll be like during the off season. And the first thing we're gonna do is go back outside because it is gorgeous out. And the water's crystal clear. It's been so quiet here. I mean, just listen, nothing. This is the first time I've actually started seeing signs of fall. Woo! It's so windy. Winter is coming. One of the things I was concerned with coming on the off season is whether we'd be able to go swimming or not. Fuck it! It'll be a new country to explore on this off-season adventure, traveling solo in Croatia. 300 steps to see a beautiful view of Split. Fire! Welcome to Klee's Fortress. We're gonna head to a town called Stari Grad. How old is this town? 3,400. I feel really connected to this place. We can go visit the old town. This gentleman <laughs> looks like he's playing a flute or uh, never mind. We'll just say he's playing a flute. The Jesuit Stairs, otherwise known as the Walk of Shame from Game of Thrones Season 5. This is stunning. This might be one of my favorite places I think I've ever been to in my life. I love it here. 